And here we go. Game number one between KT and Spenu. He may regret this. He can't duel with score early. Score also full HP. Yeah, and he's okay. gonna get he's got seen. that red buff too. Okay. Oh yeah, finds a wild catch has like no health. This is certainly gonna be first blood. And there it is. Not even burning that flash. Catch no, he's, he's was caught and trading some damage there. Well, mostly coming from arrow. And this bottom lane, the dual lane rather for KT, uh, not, not really having much of a problem either. Score over the wall onto Sol. They're going to ult someday. Going to try to make a play. He's going to go under turret, taking some damage. Sol comes back in with the twist advance. Kill goes to score and someday still makes it out. Now he's going to try and kill Sol under the turret. Well, he's got the, oh, he's no, he's got the timers on absolutely everything yep. right now in yep. Spenu's jungle. So he can just keep doing this. And Catch doesn't have anything. Uh, so. Someday with the ult again. Yep, they're going to just try to dive Sol under his turret. Worked once before. Someday taking a lot of damage, though. Going to get out with the playful Trickster. Unfortunately for him, Score takes the kill again. But it's bad when your top laner is the same level as your opponent's team to support. There's uh, a gonna flash. Go Pulverize and Peekaboo. No way he's getting out of that one. Well, there goes the perfect game. Arrow makes it out. <laughs> But uh, a very well coordinated gank for Spenu. That's fun. Meanwhile, tier uh, tier two went down a bot. Looks like oh, flash pulverize. They do catch Pickaboo. Pickaboo getting very low, exhausted, gets taken out by Victor Sassen with a kill there. So Spenu finds a catch, but catch got caught. And will he be able to get out? Siver alt popped someday on the side trying to flank. There's another kill for Score because why not? We're giving them all the score today. Oh, and Sol comes back in, still very low level, and there's Nagne finally with his first kill of the game. Oh. Score very upset with that one. <laughs> <laughs> and Score just kind of hanging out. Are oh, they going to try to pull that red buff back? Wow, this is like the biggest fight over red buff I've seen in a while. They did get the stun down onto Secret, but he backs away. Oh, wow, huge three man knock knockout up. by Score. Takes a lot of damage, though, from Sassen coming back in there. They're going to go after Secret. Someday is right there. Meanwhile, Big Emperor's Divide pushes everybody into the waiting clutches of Someday. Going after Catch. Going to get a kill there. Soul makes it out. Another kill for Score, though. Yep. Hanging out. Here she comes. Someday. Looking like he wants to go in. Secret with another nice engage here. They don't really catch him with the parallel convergence. Arrow hiding away, doing some damage. Soul gets a little bit too close. Takes a ton of hits here. Dragon still doing a lot of damage to Spenu. There goes Soul. Secret comes back in, knocks away a score. They manage to take out someday, though. A Here double kill, though, for Arrow. Double kill comes in. Triple kill comes in for Arrow. Pickaboo with the stun. That's a quadra kill for Arrow. Is he going to get the Penta nuclear? Getting very low. Trying to get a Pickaboo. Penta, Penta kill, kill for Arrow. Arrow. Second That's of the scene. second one. <laughs> wow. Well, Scuttle Crab. <laughs> Scuttle Crab gets the Penta yet again. <laughs> See Catch taking a lot of poke damage and Siveralt coming through. Score. Yeah, gonna score start corralling them. They're Secret's, going for it. Wow, they managed to jump onto Pickaboo right away. Secret's been doing such a good job of setting up some kills. Meanwhile, though, action in the base as someday trying to end it right now. Arrow getting chased down by Catch gets caught himself, though. Two more kills. Well, let's just give Arrow some more kills, huh? Sassen gets caught with that boomerang blade, and there's the surrender no. right before Sassen dies. Oh, no, they got the Nexus. Never mind. <laughs> it was not a surrender. It was Never just mind. That was just Nexus dying. I didn't realize he was killing it so fast. <laughs> he has a sheen, so I he's going to get works. through that Nexus. Well, welcome once again to Summoner's Rift. KT Rolster. Being taken, and Nogne's gonna smell this. Catches just by himself right there. Oh boy, Chilling Smite used, but here comes Nogne with a lot of damage. Exhaust, Secret trying to save the day, but the damage comes in, and first blood goes to Arrow. As I thought it was. I mean, I haven't seen it, but whatever. All right, catches that, here, he sees score. Isn't that the one where they fight the giant whale? I have no idea. Okay, oh, score gets caught. Yeah, they're gonna go in and pops his ult anyway. Is anyone coming to save him? There's a the flash. Ghost Nogne uh -oh. is here to save people. That's right, no man, that is a real live Nogne, and he is dangerous. Soul taken <laughs> out by Nogne. <laughs> All right, that was pretty clever, Doha. I gotta hand that one to you. <laughs> For Riot, it's a little bit too fast, too furious. We got a nerf. Oh, Pikaboo's still low, but they're gonna go after Secret. He does have his ult now, though, so. Yeah, so does Pikaboo. Oh, Pikaboo! <laughs> oh, stuck around a little bit too long. Nice snipe by Sasen. No emotion. <laughs> He's like, yes, he deserves it. I'm just that. bad at that. Oh. Well, a little scuffle. Yeah. So I'm going to try and finish this one off. Did have a nice equalizer that time, getting some 
quality auto attacks down, but it's just not going to be enough damage to kill the tree. Uh, not quite, but it well, will be hello, when Nogne okay. comes in. Yep, there's the Chaos Storm goes down. Soul flashes, flash from Nogne for the damage. Soul comes back in just to kind of hang out. Soul's still alive. Goodbye. Two shot barrage <laughs> not connecting. Well, it might have hit someday, actually. Yeah, Spenu putting some pretty good pressure on. Yeah, I'm not sure they're actually going to be able to capitalize on this, though, with the victor still under the turret. Oh, they're going to try and dive, actually. Yeah, Smart call. Yeah, nice knock up on the Nogne. Seeker comes in as well. Nuclear finishes that one up. But here comes the Equalizer. Someday coming down. He's on his own a little bit. Soul pops that ultimate. Now everyone on Spinu chasing Flash from the wall from Samsung. They're going to turn around. I mean, someday, not Samsung. Someday gets a kill there. <laughs> in 40 seconds or so. And they really want to make a play on the Sasson. They're going to do a lot of damage. There we go. And they just blow him up right before Dragon comes out. And no Dragon to take. So they're just going to go have to go for the lanes. And Nagne has done a great job of just slowly pushing down that mid lane. Oh, maybe some action down in the jungle here. Secret with a two-man knockup score and Pikachu chasing, though. There's a knockup on the Secret. Catch there as well, too, but he's got to be careful. Arrow running away, taking some damage early on, but here comes Nogne. So KT turning this around. They use the Evelyn ult. Score going on to Nuclear Secret. Very low true shot barrage. Takes a big chunk out of Nogne, but they manage to take down Secret anyway. A kill for Arrow. I'm just looking for uh, for ways to get you killed, though. <laughs> well, I'm glad we've got that out in the open now. You know, I've... I've suspected for a few years. Oh no, I'm on record. I'm glad it's. I'm glad it's on uh, on tape. Yep. <laughs> if I disappear tonight, guys, you know who did it. It was Doa front flip. Sorry. Whoa, they're gonna go in with the righteous glory. There's equalizer all over Spenu Nagne getting knocked up, getting pushed back into the fight though. And Spenu looking really good in this one. A lot of damage coming in from Nagne though before he went down. KT might be able to turn it around, but Sasson firing a lot from the outside, and it looks like that's gonna be a one fight for Spenu here. I think they need to replace their jungler, but uh, <laughs> they're, they're not doing bad as a team. Well, score getting a bit caught. Nuclear going for another kill there. They force a flash out of score. Oh, Sasin catches him with the two shot barrage. That's what I'm talking about, man. Sasin so has good. been very dangerous on this rune glaive, Ezreal. You and can KT. Uh, they will. Someday, remember, he has a lot of damage on this rumble, but they should see this coming. A good equalizer could make things tough. Oh, flash knock up onto Sunday. Gets pushed back. No Zonias, no life. Gets the equalizer down at the very end, but not before Soul gets in the back line onto Nogne. Pickaboo chunked out as well. True Shot Barrage nearly taking out. Well, probably will end in sadness for them. Could be. Uh oh. Oh, uh -oh. score is in a bit of trouble. It's okay. He's got his W. Are you sure? Yep. Are you sure it's, it's okay? Because here comes Catch. They get the flash. There's a the flash knock up. Oh. True Shot Barrage comes through. Oh boy. And no one was there to try and punish Spenu. Now they do have to use the Alistair ultimate, but score down at this crucial fifth dragon. A teleport came down from Someday. He has to flash to get away looking for a good equalizer, doesn't find it. I mean, result. they have to fight this. Yeah, they can't let them have a fifth dragon. Losing score, though, is going to make it very tough. All right, I guess they're just going to give up dragon number five. Or are they? Here they come in. Nogne trying to steal. Sasin manages to get it. Soul right on top of him. Goodbye, Nogne. Another kill for Sasin. Now, Spenu with that fifth dragon now is on track to win a game against probably the toughest opponent they've won a game against this season. A stupid false sense of security. I think so too. Oh boy. But you know what, Doa? What? When Runeglaive Ezreal exists, you can never allow yourself to be lulled into a false sense of security. That's oh, he true. nearly killed oh Nuclear, but that's wow. it. <laughs> Seeker comes back in. There's a kill on Anagne. Now Seeker picking up one via some damage from the rest of his team. Well, the only option here, Pikaboo just needs to build a death cap. Oh, someday. Jumped on by Soul. Drops that equalizer. Gets very, very low, though. There's the Zonias. KT trying to turn this one around. Nice big knockup from Secret, though. Alt from Pikaboo looks good, though. But man, Spenu's just way too powerful. Sasin. Nearly took down Pickaboo, but Arrow blocked a shot there. And that should be the end of the game. I don't think they can stop Spenu from killing these turrets now. They're going to try. Catch a bit low, but he's the only one that really needs to worry right now. Holy cow. Arrow just getting hugely chunked out. There's just no tools left. Oh, the inhibitor yeah. respawns, but well, that's only going to deny anyway. another wave. There's the Void Rush coming in from Catch. Yep, that's right. No big deal. And Spenu looking to close it out. 
and somehow, some way, taking a win in game number two against KT Rolster. Wow, GG. Well, that's that a very was... big win for Spenu. KT's certainly the best team they've managed to defeat. They still haven't won a best of three this season. Welcome to Summoner's Rift. Spenu Sonic Boom versus KT Rolster. He went back and got his, just was doing some standard counter jungling. Here oh, we go. Here we go. Yan to pick a boot. Nuclear takes a lot of damage, though. Score. Zoning people out. Secret pushing everybody back, but it pushes people towards nuclear. Arrow can't quite get him, though. Here we First go. First blood goes to Nogne. Nice. Meanwhile, there's a double kill for Nogne after that. He comes down, makes a difference, and now they're trying to go after Catch. Yeah. We'll see actually, Nagne slipped sneak down through. Now. Oh, yeah. interesting. He actually made it through. They scared Spenu off enough with the poke from Arrow that he was able to make it through. That does allow Sasan to push the lane. Spenu. This dragon's going down. Can Ketch come in and get it? They find someday. They prevent the flank. Dragon getting very low. Ketch going right in. They don't get the dragon. It does go to KT. Soul comes in. Everyone be gets knocked back by Secret. But KT's looking very good in this team fight. Catching a little bit of trouble. Someday goes into the back lines. Nobody dead on KT just yet. So two kills and a dragon. We'll see what he can do with it. Spenu pushing up the mid lane a little bit. And wow, with some action onto Secret. Knock up head by Pulverize. Secret getting caught there. Uses his ultimate. Not really going to help him too much. He's still going to go down. And KT, there's the ultimate from Peekaboo. Thought they might want to continue engaging, but turning around. Oh, walk away. Now they're going to try and teleport. Soul trying to come in onto arrow here, but Peekaboo's right there with the Pulverize. He walked right into it. Score coming in. They're going to catch him, throwing him against the wall. There's the exhaust as well. And Soul, very tanky, taking a lot of damage. Oh, whoa, he gets the kill on the arrow. Double kill as well as he takes out Score. That is insane. A double kill for Soul. And Sasa doing a good job of zoning here. Where's Maokai? There, oh, there he, he is. is. Coming in now. Nagne still needs to get there, though. Oh, Baron geez. getting low. Oh, and Someday, he got the Baron. Nagne comes in for a lot of damage. There's a double kill for Someday as well. And Spenu has made a huge error. Oh man, Sasan trying to clean stuff up. He's able to finally take down somebody someday, but they lost the Baron. Yeah, nobody yes. else seems to have it. Yep. Everyone was dead or either died in the fight. Oh, Dragon Whirlwind reset. comes in. That's right. Yeah, KT having a little bit of a struggle with this one. The poke is still good. Score doing it. Catch comes in. Score still gets the dragon. Catch is going to get taken down. The rest of the fight happening. Pickaboo goes in for the headbutt. Pulverize onto Sasan. Wow, that's a big chaos storm. A lot of damage coming in from Nogne. He's going to grab a killer too. Secret taken out by Arrow in the back lines, and that's another double for Nogne after that dragon. Only nuclear making it out. Score's going to have a hard time getting through try. They're going to pop that Righteous Glory to try to get a little bit more mobility. Sasan over the wall. KT bottled up. A little bit low health. They're having to kind of kite this one out. I don't know if they actually have the two. Spenu, this I don't is... know if they can get on to. I don't know, man. KT, oh, it's a lot of damage on the catch. Poked right here. That's right. Someday going in on to catch now. There we go. Head with Pulverize in to score. Score a little bit low. Soul low. Arrow takes him out. Arrow, though, trades. Nuclear gets a kill as well. Two, two come in for Spenu. KT chasing through. They're going to get the AD carry. Nice Pulverize on the Nuclear. And Pickaboo's going to pick up a Bloodthirsty one as well. Knock up onto Someday, though. Spenu still chasing. And they're actually going to come out of this fight ahead over the wall. And there's a kill for Sasin. And that's going to pick off the tier two in the bottom sides. And that's going to be them just doing it over. But they have not accounted for this ward. Yeah, they haven't seen it yet. And the Baron is dropping very fast. But Spenu knows exactly what's up. KT must be aware that they know now, too. They're backing off. Yeah, they found Soul, though. Caught him a little bit. Nagne getting very low. Catch getting in with the knockup as well. Spenu, they're going for it, man. Catch gets very low. There's a kill for Nagne, though. And Emperor's Divide pushes everybody back. Double kill for Nagne and KT. They can just turn onto this Baron if they want to. Nagne still going after catch. There's a triple kill for Nagne on that victor. Wow. Yeah, well, this he just has oh, no threat. And they're just going to go right in right now. TP yep. straight to, towards the inhibitor. They have a Lich Bane. Uh, they have a Trinity secret. Force. And they can definitely get this as long as Nagne doesn't die. Nuclear trying to... Get some damage onto Nogne, prevent him from grouping up, but that's not going to work. And someday they're going to cut off their exit back into their own base. I mean, Nuclear just on the outside looking in. Yeah, they're going to go after these Nexus turrets now. And with the long death timers that Soul, Catch, and Sasan have to deal with, it looks like this is going to be it. And KT Rolster looks like they will take that 2-1 victory over Spenu Sonic Boom. Thought it'd be 2-0, but interesting match to say the least and that is it gg yeah that is going to be it and kt well, at least they take the victory if it wasn't cleanly spenu putting up much more of a fight here this evening kt very methodical
And welcome to Sumner's Rift. CJ Antis versus Nodge in the Empire. So here we go. Oh, yeah, a gank coming in onto Coco. He could be in a little bit of trouble here. He has no idea. He's got a backup. His jungler's there, but he doesn't know there are two people here. Yeah, that's right. Coco trying to get away immediately with the flash, getting very, very low. Mission coming in, and Mad Life, or Pure rather, grabs that first blood. Well, either way, at least no flash is burned on the side of CJ to get away from that. Flash used by Watch in that case. Uh, oh, watch. watch getting caught and no flash. Turns out that's pretty important as he's going to get taken out. Ambition with the kill there. The exhaust onto Goong now. He's in a bit of trouble. Tries to flash away, but now no escape. Here comes Space, who gets the kill. Looks like it's going to go to Coco. <laughs> they want just, to even up that mid lane. It just. <laughs> I didn't see it all that quick. I was looking at something else on the screen. Oh, uh, sure. Geez. Okay. You were looking at something else for your entirety of American history. <laughs> hey, I'm Boom! Sure, I'm sure I remembered that at one point. Oh, flash stun on Coco. There's a death mark, and he is uh, probably not going to live. Oh, never mind. Yep, Goon goes in for the kill. And Shy getting pretty strong, and CJ. Oh, there we go. Knock up onto Goon. Could be in a little bit of trouble. Tries to go in for the death mark on Coco, but it's not enough damage. Coco lives through that one. That's a kill for ambition. He should be okay, yep. Just takes the tunnel. He has he has ambition tunnels in reserve. That's right. Oh, oh Mad Life. Sure. Alt on to pure. Oku getting very low as well, too, via space. There's the alt. Mad Life <laughs> takes the kill from space. Oh, well. Goon, so they're going to lose it. Pure looking for an alt here. Ah, I watch. Mad Life zoning watch very, very nicely. Finds him. That passive sun is going to be trouble. There comes a burst. Space with a kill there. Two-man Tibber's sun, but no follow-up for Najin. Goon coming in. Death mark onto Space. He could be in a lot of trouble. There's the exhaust. Doesn't matter. Space goes down anyway. Goon gets a kill, but gets taken out by Ambition. Now OQ in a lot of trouble. Can't get the kill on Mad Life before Coco takes him down. Nope, sun onto Ambition. He could be in a little bit of trouble here. Goon going in. Wow. Death mark on Ambition. That was a bit overly bold. But here comes the rest of Dodgen, so they might have a chance here. Duke going deep, but Mad Life zoning quite well. The stuns from Rum are helping so much in space. Picks up a kill with the ultimate true shot. Barrage comes, comes through. Doesn't Ezreal. hit anyone. But Ezreal can do a lot more damage. That great equalizer. Double kill for space. It's going to be a double kill for Coco as well. Make that an ace as Ambition picks up the last one. A perfect ace for CJ, and they're going to grab the dragon as well. Welcome to Stomp Town. And remember, Coco and Shy were not even there for the start of the fight. Yeah. Goon tries to ult the. That's just annoying. Yeah. Watch setting up for a flank. This is actually good. It's yeah. very, very good. Teleport coming in. Nice ult by Eve. She manages back out. Tippers comes down. Space in a lot of trouble. Here tries to cleanse. Gets killed anyway. Duke trying to back off now as well. Nice equalizer comes down. Can CJ turn this one around? I don't think so. Double kill for OQ coming in now. Shy in a little bit of trouble. He's tanky, but they need more than that right now. And Zonius, there we go. Goon with the kill. And now OQ on the run. Ambition wants to take him out. Oh, Can he do it? Ambition gets the kill in the end, but he'll be taken out eventually. Oh, wow. There's the ace. That was a great setup from Najin, honestly. They did yeah. not expect Watch to be able to get into position behind them. See Goon playing the long game here. Wanting to come through, but there's so many CJ wards now. Oh, Flash Tibber is really, really nice. Mad Life in a little bit of trouble. True Shot Barrage in the middle, but is it Holy enough damage? Holy cow, space? that equalizer. No kidding. Yeah, Space doing a lot of damage here. Finally gets taken out by Goomba. Coco untouched in this fight so far. Mad Life has to stay on the outside. They're going to trade fairly evenly. Najin getting a bit of an edge, but CJ chasing. That's a lot of damage coming from Shy. And Duke comes back in to sacrifice his life for his team. Coco, though, wants the kill onto OQ, and he's going to get it. Needlessly large rod now as well, too, so the damage continues to mount for CJ. Oh, trying to catch Watch. Nice Q from Mad Life. Wow, what a catch. Getting that slow from the Q. <laughs> Watch is really misusing his W this game. Yeah, he tried to use it to get away again and then got hit with the slow. It's time to hide in the pit and maybe do the Baron. Ward is there. They should see that Ward. This is still a dangerous Baron for CJ. Mm, Pure has uh... Tibbers. They're going to try to come in. Here Duke comes has Duke. Double bit. Zoning equalizer. Pierre comes in to try to do something. Goon. Coco's just Zonia's that death mark. Goon gets exhausted immediately. Mad Life low. But Goon can't even get that kill. Oh, actually. Oh, no, he doesn't. Nope. Now CJ just turns. There goes Pure. 
Shy taking that one out. Coco continuing to poke people to death. Ambition with another kill. Now they'll just casually turn and finish Baron. A double <laughs> kill for Ambition at the end of that one. Classic League of Legends problem. Oh, he's back. Flight wards are great. He's like, there's no Look ward. Look at the, this they have rush. two pink wards behind them for Evelyn. Oh, well, Tibbert's trying to engage space in a little bit of trouble. D gets a cleanse, gets taken out though. Goon, very, very low. Coco doing tons of damage. Space, still the only victim. He's been dying a lot, but CJ's been able to clean up. They took out Goon, Shy trying to dodge watch. Oh, a double kill for uh, Coco during all that. I mean, it doesn't matter how many times Space dies. Not really, and watch a little bit of trouble. There we go, triple kill for Coco. <laughs> I mean, they try it all in on Space every time. He, oh. he takes. Oh, wow. He, I bet it back to yeah, <laughs> There's yeah. like, well. Better go back there. <laughs> Time to go. Probably just the inhibitor, too. Yep. They will get it. OQ pops that ultimate. They want to go in on this one. Watch gets a nice ult as well. But the, t oh, man. Equalizer comes down, and that gives CJ a really nice position to approach this fight. Duke already chunked down after being so tanky. Watch is taken out by Coco. Bramalt catches him. Another double kill for Coco. Huge game. Sonia is to avoid the death from Who wants a kill. There's the death mark. Goodbye before the exhaust can come down. Oh, but Space wants a bit of revenge. Goon's killed him too many times this game. <laughs> oh, he's going to get away anyway, though. I guess CJ can't quite end it yet. All yep. right. Now they're going to try to engage as well. CJ's cutting back. Gets caught with Timbers, though. Mad life in the back line, so the tank's doing what they need to do in space. For once, not quite dead yet. There's Zonia's for Shy, again, creating that flame splitter wall. Madlife gets caught, though, with another son. OQ doing a lot of damage. Najin turning this one around a bit. Yes, but what are they going to lose? I mean, there wasn't a lot of super minions there yet. They're so tanky. Well, Watch comes in. They're going to try to make something happen. Nice knockup from Ambition, keeping them from getting it too far. Whoa, that's a lot of AoE, though. Exhaust on Goom, trying to get a kill here. Duke, very low. Barely dodges that Mystic shot. Wow, Duke. Amazingly, nobody died there. The summoner heal actually saved Duke to get him out of range. Yeah. Of that last Mystic shot, CJ can't quite take the Baron, but Najin actually hanging in there. Here comes Void Rush and TP. Uh -oh. oh, they're going to go after Goon oh, here. Whoa. What? Space? All right, Space just decided to, uh, to die, apparently. Watch is right there, though. Ambition going really deep. Gets a knock up on Goon. Where's the follow up, though? They need Coco to come up big here. He does. He gets a kill onto Oku. Double kill. Another one for Coco. He didn't have enough apparently yet. Make it a triple, his second of the game so far. Man, OQ's having a huge game. Goong. Might yeah. as well try soon. Well, He's going to try there, now. Get there quick with home guards. Oh, they're going to engage as well, too. Three man Tibbers. Man, pure is good. Space just cleanses, though. Moves out. There's the ultimate coming through. Watch trying to do as much damage as he can. Goong tries to get into the back lines. Manages to kill Space. And Najin actually might be able to take this fight. Ambition, a lot of trouble, too. Double kill for OQ. Oh, boy. Space gets to kill himself, too. But Najin takes the fight off a triple kill from OQ. They are still alive. What a bloodbath. And that three man stun from Pure with that Tibbers. Beautiful, beautiful Annie play. <laughs> I mean. Najin needs this dragon. They need it. Yeah, they, that's a great way to deny it, though. They're yeah. using the strength of what they have right now. And here comes the fight. You can see that oh, everybody's server. just. Yep, Teleport coming in. The CJ choke. pulling back. This equalizer could be very, very good for CJ. There we go. Space and Coco with plenty of space to fight. Goon gets the kill on the Mad Life, but now CJ on the chase. OQ running a little bit, gets poked very hard by Coco. Deathmark coming in onto Coco, just zones it immediately. Goon in a lot of trouble. Space with the kill onto OQ. Goon, GA pops, but that is going to be a dead set. Double kill for Space. And the setup was so good oh, from yeah. CJ. You could see how they were just tightly kiting from that choke point, they pulled the daring fight them choke. to go through. And again, Shy hits a very good equalizer in that game to provide the necessary zone. Yeah, there's a lot of minion waves, but there are some long, long death timers. Yeah, only Pure and Watch able to try to defend the Nexus, and it is not going to be enough. Watch coming in onto Ambition tries to get the kill, but that's not going to help. Not going to do anything there. Pure has had a great game, but that is going to be about it. Coco trying to get the kill on the pier here. Another stun. That is it. GG and CJ wins a pretty nail biting game one at 51 minutes, 57 kills in the game. 59 kills, actually. <laughs> Our highest kill game so far of the season. You're crazy. All right. Welcome to Summoner's Rift once again. So do you if you have enough money, Noah. <laughs> I guess. That's true. <laughs> 
I'm no George Jetson, though. Pretty sure, uh, pretty sure there's some Russian rockets oh. you could take if you're a millionaire. Uh-oh. Oh, who gets the rock? Who gets the rockets? Who gets the red buff? Oh, watch, decides he wants to come back in. That's a bad idea. Knocked up. Will it be first blood? There's the exhaust. They really want this one. And it will be. Mad Life grabs it. Meanwhile, more kills come in. What Here was, we go. What was Shy doing there? I he was just no left idea. by himself. He didn't even have any HP at the end. Came and dropped the equalizer. That's right. Oh. Oh. Oh, Yay. it's time. It's time to take the dragon. Oh, Q landed by Watch, though. They're going to try to contest this. Watch coming in. CJ has chosen a difficult time. Brahmalt used. Mad Life getting very low. Dragon taken by CJ. They get a kill, too. On to pure. Space grabs one. Oh, Coco getting very low. Has to flash over the wall. Chaos Storm comes back in. They're going to turn around on this one. Ambition on the run now. OQ nearly taken out oh. by Space. Well, Mad Life Ooh. dies almost to the death laser, but then doesn't. That was a, <laughs> I don't know. It. I thought he was going <laughs> to die. Had to turn that sentence around in a hurry, man. <laughs> that was implement of ranged combat. Uh oh, TP. Yep, they're coming in there. Wow, Annie goes down in a pretty big Tibbers. And OQ actually getting a lot of auto attacks in on this fight. Really good positioning there for him. Kills coming in for Goong as well. Ambition very low. OQ with another one here. Watching a lot of trouble. Looks like CJ's going to try to start to turn this one around. Nice zoning by Azir. Victor has to go for a run there. That means oh, away from no. the fight. Coco coming in. Ember survived. He doesn't catch Oku, but he gets the kill anyway. And Goon. here we go. Shy. Whoa. One more from Oku or from Coco. Do it. Triple kill for Coco. He's starting it again. And now Duke in a lot of trouble. Shy. There's a flash. Looks like they couldn't quite catch him. Yeah, can't wow. quite pursue it under turret. Coco's positioning. He was in the dragon pit. Well. Just looking, whoa, big fight in the mid lane suddenly out of nowhere. Exhaust on Dagoon, Mad Life wades in the middle of things, but Dodgin catching a couple of members of CJ, but here comes Space to fight the 1v4, I guess. He's like, no, that's a bad idea, I'm, I'm running away. Wow, that was a very surprising bait from Dodgin, but yeah. I don't really know what Ambition and Mad Life were doing I there. I want to see Just a replay of that. that trying to get some wards, but they had no... Oh, several pop. The teleport's going to come in as well, too. How are they going to handle it? Duke goes in, and oh, they're going to kick space right into the enemy team. He's going to flash over the wall, though. There's a knock up on Duke. Nice equalizer from Shy, actually. Duke over the wall onto space. It's like a 1v1, but space will win it. And CJ taking this fight. Coco over the wall onto OQ. Wow. Nice effort to fight for the double kill. Man, Coco's good, and Shy takes out Goong. And that is nearly an ace. Nobody on CJ going down. Wow, that was such an aggressive move. Fight. Ambition, though, coming in. He may want to do something. Coco trying to flank from the side here. Has that Emperor's Divide, and they're going to slow down Duke. There's okay. Equalizer. Emperor's Divide pushes people in. Duke comes in. He's separated from the rest of his team. There's a kill for CJ. Whoa, big gravity field, big chaos storm. But everybody on CJ escapes for now anyway. Wow, so low. Koku, Oku and Ambition are up. Coco and Ambition. Coco. Coco. They've combined into one carry. <laughs> Simply gonna take a lot of damage. Oh, now they're going to go in trying to stun Coco, but he is able to get out with that cleanse. Equalizer comes down, splits up Dodgen quite nicely. Bad Life kicked in the back lines. Dodgen chasing away a member of CJ down the bottom. Oh, Space actually gets away there. Has to burn both summoners to do it. Which is, I think, what he's going to do here. Whoa, they totally caught Duke. Oh, man, what a huge mistake for Dodgen. Bad Life blocking a lot of the... Attacks coming in from Najin there. Watches back up, but there's a knockup. They're just going to pick apart Najin piece by piece. There goes Oku. Slow down on Dagoon. Gets exhausted. They're going to keep chasing him. Shy trying to cut him off, but they may decide to turn. Ooh, Mad, Life Mad Life just got very low. Barely living at the edge of that Chaos Storm. Goon now has no ultimate. They're kind of running out of tools, but Ambition and the rest of CJ are running out of HP. Yeah, I don't know about this, man. Uh, they're going to try to zone watch, but this Baron is very risky. Mad Life really can't even survive being hit by Baron right now. Um, They're going to get it anyway, though. Yeah, and looks like they have to go back to deal with this naked inhibitor in the bottom lane. Get the last gank. Whoa, Goon gets some damage onto Ambition. This could be it. Teleport coming in. They're going to from behind. Emperor's Divide used fairly early. A lot of damage onto, whoa, actually, Space taken out immediately. CJ on the disengage now. Duke wades through the team. Uh, here come the minions now. CJ moving in. Will Najin decide to engage on this watch? Tries to land a Q. Can't do it. There's Sivir of ultimate. Duke goes in on the Mad Life right away. Coco 
poking from the side. Great equalizer again from Shy. Pure trying to get something happening over the wall, but doesn't do it. Just gets poked out. Goodbye, Duke. Exhaust on the Goong as well. CJ a bit low. Oh Emperor's my. Divine catches everybody. Immediate zone news from Coco just to keep himself safe. Double kill though for Goong. Turns it around, but a double kill for Oku as well. And wow, four members dying. Coco couldn't actually finish anyone off when he went in. Well, two CJ's not killing it very fast. This could be really risky. Oh boy, watch coming in right now. Once it gets something happened, there's the ult for Mad Life. Knocks up Goong. They do take the bear, and Equalizer comes through to try to separate Najin away. Shy getting a nice flame splitter in there. Coco taking a lot of damage. Watch ends up in the back lines. Gets very, very low. Emperor's Divide saves Coco for now. Wow. A kill for space. Dude, CJ manages to keep most everybody alive. Yeah, they're Oki on with the, the double run, kill, though. though. Look how low the members of Najin are. There's yeah. Shy just flashing for him. Why not? Yeah. Trying to take up here over the wall, gets him with the flame spitter. Oh, Duke gets caught a little bit. Goon comes in, twist advance, so who catches who? Zonius for Shy immediately. Whoa, Goon does a ton of damage. Coco doesn't escape. Boku comes in and closes it off. And Najin turning oh, this one around. Oh boy. That could have been the game right there. Wow. Ambition may try to go to for a backdoor. Mad Life and Ambition are on a secret mission into the enemy base with super minions. They've got super minions. If the support and jungle manage to do this, it's oh. gonna be amazing. Well, no, they got Goon one next to Surrit. Well, yeah, but they're real tanky. Uh, yeah. Well, they actually forced the recall. Okay. Wow. Well, they forced the recall from some of them. They still may lose this inhibitor. In fact, they certainly will. Uh, yeah, they are. How much are they going to lose, though? Mad Life and... Oh, this is going to be so close, Doa. Uh, they're going to lose the inhibitor for sure. Mad Life still kind of keeping Goong occupied. Oh, here we go. Ambition on his own, trying to save the game, trying to save this 2-0. For CJ, gets the knock up onto Duke. There goes one turret. Minions coming out There's now, so though. There's so many super minions. That's right. Ambition getting very low. He's going to flash away. Does not want to deal with that death timer. There goes the second turret, though. Still 20 seconds. I think Najin's got this. I don't know. Mad Life's nearly back. Ambition coming through. Can they get it? No, they can't stop them. Najin coming in. Mad Life trying to do something. Oh Doesn't have my. his own. There goes the Nexus. And Najin, beyond all expectations, manages to take game two. Wow. What an <laughs> insane comeback from Najin. I mean, mistakes were made from CJ. <laughs>